showcase of the Goku Black and Zamasu. So this is a character that, for one, the Z power bonuses on the banner are insane. I think I pulled them three times, four times. Anyways, they stonewalled me every time I got a Trunks animation, which was actually a couple of times. It was them. And I'm like, dude, where's my Trunks at? So yeah, you will not be seeing a Trunks showcase from me tonight. Uh, I'll probably do another video. I'll try to probably go back in in a couple of days after the uh, Black Friday and see how much I actually got before I get paid in the beginning of the month. I need to make sure that I budget appropriately for this week because I'm looking at a few things that I'm trying to pick up. Uh, so that being said, I can't go too heavy until next week. So we'll see what happens. Maybe I get lucky or maybe things switch up for me a little bit. Uh, so yeah, I'm missing Trunks and I'm missing Broly, but I did get a lot of copies of this character and the other characters on the banner. Anyways, 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 in terms of how things are looking, very defensive character. I'm going to tell you right now, uh, they get a lot of cuts. And outside of the cuts, the main thing you need to know about is like the health restoration on switch out for allies, which does apply to themselves. Uh, so they are going to heal every time they switch out. They pick up plus draw speed whenever they cover in, which is pretty awesome, too. While also randomly destroying one of your cards, giving you a green card twice, reducing enemies key. Uh, they have automatic abilities in here. They've got a lot of just different things. They have uh, main ability ceiling, which I admittedly I'll probably forget about, but it activates twice for 10 counts, which is very uh, important. They have a one time enemy vanish gauge reduction to zero which is crazy with the green they pick up the greens automatically twice you can get bonus damage to hybrids and sands two times so 40 percent when you use this multiple uh times outside of that you know a couple of times it almost does nothing anymore after a while but it does do the debuffs and the key bonus the blue card reduces the dragon balls this is like a character that they said okay let's just give them like every damn thing we can think of they got damage buffs they've got a lot of damage cuts especially early in the game they cut a lot of damage so you'll see them stonewalling uh they also have a lot of things like just like i guess a disruption with debuffs or dragon ball disruption like whatever they just gave them everything so interesting character uh, i'm excited to see how they age z ability is also really good um and the main ability again heals they got a blue card damage blue card draw restores key uh gradual restoration of health like they've got a a lot really built in here um so what we did here was we are using selling the later slot because uh he wouldn't be offering his z ability to like vegeto blue outside of that the rest of the team is pretty much fine but this is a really good usage of the leader ability it, to just kind of fix up some z abilities on a, a pretty relevant team or, or pretty cohesive team this is just a future team right uh so they are also going to be good on like god keys stuff like that they're interesting to see i think that some of those teams have good competition though specifically like god key uh i don't think you would consider i mean i guess if you really need vados she's in the running of competition but mainly like uh you have topo there and you have beerus there to consider but they feel almost like a better version of beerus in my mind with the debuffs and disruption type stuff while also still doing the main seal so like you probably are better off between them or topo depending on picking your poison there uh but they are going to be an awesome character i think nonetheless and i'm excited to see how they age because they have a lot of things built in their kit so forgive me throughout the showcase if i just kind of forget one or two things that they're doing it's not that anything other than the fact that they are brand freaking new characters and i'm trying to show you these characters so a couple of matches i'm going to try to go out of my way to see their defensive value because that's mainly what what they're built around and uh some matches we're going to really see the offense anyways here we go So, could be a Demon King Piccolo sub, obviously. See how well they tank versus him, too. Early green, Q restore, blah, blah. They're tanking really well in general here. Very impressive. Should use my green there. It's all right, though. I don't mind not using it. Yeah, honestly, very impressive. That's going to hit. And I'll be able to get a Dragon Ball here. Even though it's disadvantage, I don't mind. Health restoration goes up as well. Uh, I'm gonna sub them out soon here, so it's all right. Mm, okay. I wonder if this is intentional. I mean, it was intentional. I wonder if it was a good play. Ah, got him. Nice. Love to see it. That's a massive payoff. He's got a sub here for sure. There it is. And there goes my Dragon Ball. Ah. 
<laughs> that main ceiling is really crazy to have. It's super crazy to have. King Piccolo just got his main unsealed and now it's back. <laughs> I'll sub. I was considering subbing sooner just to destroy a Dragon Ball on self's cover, but I got too fun. I, I had too much fun leaving them in to test their defenses. Oh, nice. I don't get punished though. I'll take it. There's another Dragon Ball destroy. So annoying. So the good news is when I pop his main, he will restore a lot of HP. <laughs> One million. Oh <laughs> that is like half <laughs> That is a lot. How much does this ult even do from Kid Blue here? I genuinely don't think it does much at all. That is actually disappointing. Perfect. Thank you. Freaking strike seal. Come on, come on, no freeze it. Alright. Should obviously be a Frieza sub here. No Frieza sub yet. Must not be available. Very interesting the way that they're playing. They're very, very, very powerful defensively as they are said to be. They're very well designed. Okay, I'll take that. Yeah. Good enough, though. Yeah, they are as advertised. I mean, I don't really need this. I mean, I could still get the, the buffs from it, I guess, and the advantage comes back. It's not terrible. One more. Okay, no. Let's bring them back here. And their cover options are so powerful, too. That's also another element. And all the healing is a lot. The party healing, I believe they, they heal party and uh, strike buff on sub out too. There's a lot kind of going on with that. He's got his gauge back. Perfect. I'll actually tackle. I don't know why he's sub there, but I'll take it. Yeah, I really think they're interesting. Their utility is pretty awesome, especially when you consider the one time uh, vanish removal. I think I tried to get that on DDK Piccolo earlier. Oh yeah, that's pretty awesome. I didn't think he was back yet. That was really quick. Ooh. Oh, this is gonna do a lot of damage to everybody. He's dead. Yep. I didn't get that. Combo done? No? Nice combo. Very long combo. Considering you just used a freaking blue. And GG's, dog. I was going to say it before they don't actually win it here. Okay, thanks. There it is. <laughs> that was a good game, though. I want to see this. That did nothing. Broly's blue does a lot of damage. I don't know if it's fully built up the way you think it would be yet, but it's designed to do a lot of damage, and that did literally nothing. I got the vanish removal for no reason because he sidestepped anyway there. Feels bad, man. Uh, he actually did it. I didn't think he would, but I'll take it. Whatever. I was considering, like, should I drop combo? It's like, no, he won't actually do it. He actually did do it. Whew. Yeah. Welcome back, Bardock. Burdock. Hello, Dragon Ball. First, I, I say goodbye, Dragon Ball. Ooh, he's like he didn't tap there. I would have got him. Speaking of Dragon Balls, goodbye. Another one and the card as well. Really love their synergy with all the Dragon Ball destruction. Ooh, nice one. Okay, let's go here. Green card, okay. Draw speed buff. He'll also pick up more buffs for the sub. But damn it, it's a drop combo, really? Go for the blue. Thank you. 
Thank you for that. Very happy I had that option. Because you can't unclick subs. You can't unclick anything, which sucks. I would have unclicked a heartbeat. Perfect. Thank you. I would have unclicked in a heartbeat if I could. They really should implement that, though. Like, unclicking rising rushes would be huge. I thought he was tackling there. He might, but I don't have to fight anyway. It's a very good way to stop their ability to freaking avoid it. And we move on. Wow, you went for that? How lucky. Okay. Another? Okay. I still don't really care about that. He's He knows that I'm trying to get his vanish uh, utility there, and he's just going around it, which is smart. It's very smart. But what more can you even do after this card that you're using here? So. He's got all the freaking blues and greens in his hand. Holy crap. <laughs> Stop. Thank you. My goodness. Hello, Goku. Of course he did. That was a great drift. Okay, the good news is Vegeta is the one that was weak to a uh, green element. Yeah, he had no choice but to do that there because he was going to lose the character. I'm so annoyed with the way I tried to get the green card earlier. I, the the no vanish after the green card earlier, and I just couldn't. That's so frustrating. <laughs> because he got all the greens and blues to begin with. Absurd. Switch and heal. Switch. There it is. It's gonna do more damage, but it won't be enough. Well. The good news is the other two characters are low, which I'm happy about. Uh, <laughs> okay, it's a lot of help there, Goku. God damn it. We've had almost that exact same exchange like three times, and he's gotten it every single time. That's because it's what he wants to see in the first place. It's not what I want to see. Not bad. Okay. 
I'm way too swipe happy. I've been hit like five times from swiping. Just need to settle down. He'll see this. Like I said, just needed to settle down. I've been way too swipe happy in this stupid match. A blast immediately. Could have tackled him. This was way too swipe happy. And it was it was like me beating my freaking self. He was good, but like that was me, man. I probably would have put Goku and Vegeta in the leader slot. Cause don't they have like God Key and weird buffs? Like that Sun Family, what like their Z ability just doesn't fit anyone on that team really. It's a like a God Key movie slash team, powerful opponent. It's kinda like all over the place. But uh yeah, I probably would put them in the leader slot. But nonetheless though, here we go. This will be our last match, guys. Hope you guys enjoy it. Here we go. Didn't expect him to lead with the Goku, but he did. Okay. Let's see how this goes. I'll start with the blast here. Blue. I'll take that early damage. He could have actually easily avoided that with the sub. But I'll take that. Should be a sub with Vegeta. Yep. Sorry, dude. I know exactly what you're trying to do with that unit. <laughs> so all that did was give me the advantage I needed. I guess it's the downside of that character if you can kind of see through the plan. You're gonna sub here, but I did just set you up for this. Sorry. Yeah, I set him up pretty well. It's like the first time I actually got that to work in this video. And it's not because of anything other than the fact that half the time I've been kind of just like getting sidestepped or things like that and actually getting it to work that way. It's just kind of weird. Okay? I was gonna say, don't be a stupid tackle, and of course it's a tackle, but thank you for the perfect, my guy. And goodbye, you are a blast character with a sprite cover, if you remember that. However, it does not matter now. I'm gonna rush here and try to set up an LF. That's perfectly fine. I was gonna say, I don't know why you would do that, but I do understand why, because they have the utility versus two of my characters. That's an incredibly powerful mechanic. <laughs> the tag switch mechanic is incredibly powerful. Literally have type advantage versus two of my characters instead of just one. Very, very powerful mechanic. Let's say I know that I'm not gonna get the stop clock here. Pretty positive. Gotta go quick, he'll dodge, that's fine. Oh, he didn't dodge. <laughs> wow, I actually thought he would dodge and it was gonna get wasted. Well, Cell pretty much soloed this unit from start to finish. Kinda sucks if you're him. I'd be upset. Didn't really get to do anything with them. Especially because the one time he tried to, I just stonewalled him because Vegeta is crappy versus Greens. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Hit that thumbs up. Ooh, that's LLF. I love it. Hope you guys enjoyed it. The thumbs up and subscribe. Check out the Goku and Vegeta showcase on my channel. Uh, and you guys will see that down below in the description or clickable on the screen. Have an awesome day, and I'll see all of you in the next one.